good morning. Wow, look, bro. Let me tell y'all something. Can, can I rent real quick? Can, can I can I can I clear my fucking chest? Can can I can I say something? I'm I'm at the gym. I'm gonna get go and work out, man. Leg day. I just seen this woman come out this fucking gym. Booty cutters. Oh, it's raining outside. The weather's bad. It's 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 drizzling. Well, it's getting better. You don't listen. If you come to a gym, you wear the fuck you want to wear. But then there are just some things you don't wear to a gym. Having some on with your ass cheeks hanging out, and then you sit your ass down on the bench and shit. I don't want to smell your yo yo ass juices when you get up from the fucking goddamn bench. You doing dumbbell work well? Cause most women be over there with the dumbbells that doing work, right? I'm leg pressing today. Some of y'all sit on the leg press machine. I don't want to sit down there and wipe up your booty juice because you want to wear booty cutters to the goddamn gym. That's bullshit. And then be sitting there, be sitting there talking about, why are you looking at me? Why, why are you staring at me? Why I'm staring at you? Because your ass is hanging out in this fucking gym. Your cheeks hanging out. This is clear as motherfucking day. Some of y'all come in for the wrong motherfucking reason. I come in to make weight babies, motherfucker, build some motherfucking muscle, make love some motherfucking weights. I don't come here to look at no ass. I'm a married man anyway, but I'm still a man nonetheless. I love women, but I'm a married fucking man, you know, happily fucking married. But you can't come here to the fucking goddamn gym, half ass naked, and then expect somebody not to say something. And then if some nigga gawk at you in the goddamn gym, I feel like my privacy's been violated. But you and this motherfucking naked, turn a fucking man in this motherfucker. Some of these men don't give a fuck. They'll sit here and look at you all goddamn day. T's hanging out. There was a woman here yesterday. T's damn near hanging all the way the fuck out. I mean, I, it's basically was out. She was basically naked. That's bullshit, man. That, that, that's foul ass shit. Then when you say something, oh my God, I feel I feel so violated. But they don't wear that shit to the fucking gym then. I tell you what, normally I don't like putting people on blast, but if, if I go in here today, if I go in there and see any fuck foul shit, I swear to God I'm going to record. Because you, some of y'all be on TikTok talking about, I feel so violated. The man, they look at me and I just feel so uneasy. But you come here half fucking naked. You like the bitch when I was pulling up, walking. I'm like, I can't believe this shit. Half fucking naked. There are just some things you don't put on. I'm sorry. You don't, you don't. Uh, I, I, if I see a guy in the gym half naked, you women need to say something. Cause I'm damn sure I'm saying, why the fuck you come in half naked, your nuts hanging out your shit, nigga? What the fuck wrong with you? Straight the fuck up. Some of y'all come here to try to get some of these men. Some of y'all come here to try to get clout on, on TikTok. Play victim and shit. And you cut that motherfucking shit out, man. For real, for real. I'm gonna be like Pike. Uh, Pike. <laughs> Pike. It ain't easy, motherfucker. You yeah. that? It ain't easy. I'm playing Gary Gore here, man. I had my coffee back there. You can probably see it in my son's seat. I had my coffee. I'm gonna get my electric lights in. I'm gonna go ahead and clang and bang. Make love to these weights. Build some motherfucking muscle. I've been quiet. I ain't been saying nothing on, on Facebook for a while. Ain't nothing to talk about. Damn, I'm sure I ain't talking about them Cowboys. They might win six games this year. Let me get their ass tore up this year. But we, we, that, we'll talk about that after the motherfucking draft. I just want to talk about this gym shit. But I'm done. I'm done bitching now. I'm done. I'm done bitching. I'm mad about the election coming up. We got two assholes don't need to be in there. Neither one of them need to be in there. We need somebody. And RFK show need to be in there. But we need somebody that can put America first, man. There's just too much going on right now. Well, at least she ain't wearing nothing too provocative. I started to put ass on Cam. She ain't wearing nothing too provocative. Some of these motherfuckers. Anyway, that's all I got, man. For real. Y'all women stop coming here half naked and playing victim and shit, man. That's all I got to say. Man had a good workout today. Just, oh my bad boss, yeah. Just seen that OJ didn't die. That's 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 weird. Ain't weird, that's life had cancer. Seen y'all already seeing some horrible shit about the juice, but hey, you know, he was a quit. Of all charges, but we know what really happened. We know what really happened. But uh condolences to the family. Um you stanky booty bitches didn't come in there on her today, huh? And uh, I was waiting on y'all. Well, I was waiting on the next motherfucker coming there with hardly nothing on. I sure had my phone today, but maybe tomorrow. I'm tired of this this rhetoric that y'all are being marginalized when you come up here half ass nigga. Finna go home, get some protein, type some programs, and listen to this OJ news and uh Listen to the, the, the news worldwide because there's a lot of shit going on. Y'all have a good one. I'm out, motherfuckers.